Hi, uh, welcome to Craig's channel. I'm playing a game called Bad Parenting, and it's the guy's first guy or gals. First game that they ever made. Um, they go by 2002, so I don't know. Story one. Mr. Redface. Come back to old Yazoo. Oh, hi. Mom, you're home late again. Come on, I was busy with work. Can you have some sympathy for me? But today is my birthday. Oh, uh, of course. I know that. Then where's my gift? Uh... Have you ever heard of Mr. Redface? <laughs> On the birthday of good children, Mr. Redface secretly leaves gifts while they are asleep. Really? Of course. If you want to get your gift, you have to go to bed right away. I'm going to bed right now, Mom. Oh, God. You're fooling the kid again. How many times have you come home this late? I was working and my shift ended late. Oh, crap. You still think I'm, a, I'm an idiot, don't you? Hey, little kid, get back to your room. Don't stand here eavesdropping on grown-up conversations. Okay. Jeez, you don't have to be such a jerk about it. Mm. Am I wearing high heels? Ooh, I can run. Woo! The sensitivity! Is this my room? It is my room. Oh, I guess I'm supposed to go to bed, right? Oh my god. The sensitivity of the mouse. Mr. Redface is gonna leave me a gift, because I went to bed like I was supposed to. Aww. That doesn't sound good. Mr. Redface. Oh. Oh, that looks like salad fingers. The animation in this is cool. I really like that. It I guess he lives in my closet. Okay. Um, are you, uh... Okay. I guess I won't look in there. Ooh, I did get a gift. Is that the gift from Mr. Redface? No way! Nice! Thanks, Mr. Redface. Hi, I'm Ron. What? You can talk? Of course, because I was created by magic. You even have the same name and appearance as me. That's right, my master made me just for you. But your neck seems a bit loose. Foreshadowing? It's okay, sometimes my master makes mistakes. This is just a small flare flaw compared to the other dolls. What's important is that from now on, I'll be your best friend. That sounds wonderful! Do you want to play something with me? Hmm, my master stored my toys in the closet. Could you get them for me? Sure, 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 sure. The closet is still stuck? Can you try that again? I've tried my best, I can't open it. Do you want me to do something else? I'm hungry. You're a doll. Can you even eat? 
No, you'll be the one eating, but I'll be able to feel everything you eat. My master linked all your senses and emotions to me, so I can easily understand you. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, that's creepy. Ugh. Oh, look at that. Pills and booze. You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you, sleepyhead? I prepared your favorite dish in the fridge. So remember, heat it up before eating. Lately, I've noticed you have been getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home, so please learn to take care of yourself and stop making me worry one more thing. Oh, sorry. Worry, period. One more thing. Don't forget to take your medicine after eating, Mom. Wait, the medicine's mine? And, excuse me, I'm a child! You're supposed to take care of me. Oops. I was, trying to, I was trying to get that. You are holding something else. Oh, where do I, do I put you down? Oh, <laughs> uh. Do I, do I, do I heat it up or what do I, oh, there we go. <laughs> are your eyes red? Is that your favorite dish? Do you want to see me perform some magic? Yes, uh, please! Alright, I'll make this plate of food never run out. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. Okay, but then Mom's going to think I'm not eating and she's going to yell at me. Wow, that's amazing! What else can you do? I don't think you should be drinking. You're, you're a doll. Oh. Is that working on me, though? Oh. What? What just happened? I don't know. You guess. Oh, no, the bottle. My dad's going to whip my butt. I hope he's still asleep. Your dad? Don't worry, my master has taken your dad away. What did you say? Uh, let me take my... I, no, no take medicine? Alrighty. Uh, dad? Dad? Oh, you're in here now, are you? Where's my dad? As I said, my master has taken your dad away. Why? Because your dad is a bad person. He often hits and yells at you. Parents like that are taken away by my master to protect children like you. But this is too much. My dad doesn't deserve that. He is a bad person. No, he's not. Please, let my dad go. I'm begging you. All right, all right. But my master won't like this. It's quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. Show me the way. The shortcut is through your closet. Alright. Oh, look at this part I found. They have separate beds. That's not good. Alright, going this way. Okay, the door went into me. see the closet. You still can't open it? That's disappointing. I guess we'll have to use your parents' closet then. Well, we were just in there. By the way, what's in there? Did I hurt my dad? Did I put him in my closet? You should know that these closets can function as portals. They can take you anywhere you want, including where your dad is being held. Give it a try.
There's nothing in here. Oh, right, I forgot. There are a few steps you need to take to activate this shortcut. Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. This radio will work like an elevator button. You need to select a frequency first. If you choose the right frequency, the door will open to the place you need to go. Seems like that's not it. Let's try again. I liked that one. I would have gone there. I think this is the one. Go ahead and step in. I'll stay here and watch the house. Okay, well, it looks cold. I, I probably should have brought a jacket and some boot. Oh, maybe not. What's this? Oh, hi. We got a campfire going. Oh, um... What is going on? Listen, lady. What's up? I'm looking for my dad. Describe. My dad's name is Bruce. Wait a moment. There are many Bruces here. Any more details? Is this Bruce a good Bruce or a bad Bruce? Well, my dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. So he's a bad Bruce. Let me see. There are so many bad Bruces. More specifics, please. What else does he do? He often yells. Still, not enough information. Sometimes he hits me. And slaps, too. And? That's all. The door is behind you. Oh, uh, hi. Boo! Ha ha ha! He just got startled. Who are you guys? Just like you, we're kids on our way to find our parents. We're staying here for a bit. Do you want to join us? I'm sorry, I'm in a hurry. Okay, see you later. Okay, yeah, you uh, play in the grave. Dad? Please stop punishing me. It's me, Dad. Please stop punishing me. What has he done to you? Come on, let's go home or Mr. Redface will take both of us. Please stop punishing me. Okay. Can I grab him? something here. Spell. Oh no, busted. Oh, I'm a, I'm dull. Okay. Hi. Stop. Stop that. Stop. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Hey, what's wrong with you? Why are you hiding in the closet? Mr. Redface has taken Dad. Oh. Well, that's a good thing, then. I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How is your doll, Ron, doing today? Is it all right? The doll? Mom, how do you know about it? Of course I know, since you haven't taken your medicine today. This isn't the first time you've had such hallucinations. Every time you tell a different story, but the common factor is always that stupid doll. Don't you remember the previous times? 
No? Sorry, I don't know what is wrong with you. Just go to bed, it's midnight already. Okay. Why don't I have to be so mean? Oh, this is your room. Okay. Go to bed, I guess. Just, uh, oh. Okay, well he's up there. Dang, Mr. Redface, why you gotta be like- Oh! What just happened, son? Are you all right? Why are you looking at me like that? Do you feel better now? No, not when you're like that. Yeah, Mom. It's Mr. Redfit. It's all right. Tomorrow I'll take a day off to stay home and take care of you. Really? Promise me, Mom. I promise. Now go back to sleep. Yes, Mom. Mom? <sighs> you broke the promise again. Maybe I should go in my room. <gasps> what happened to you? <laughs> my master beat me up. He wasn't happy about what happened yesterday. I'm sorry. This is my fault. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? My master has taken her away. What? It just happened. I'm sorry, I couldn't stop him. You should run away, because he'll come back soon, to take you two. No, I have to save my mom and my dad too. How? Don't you see what he did to me? I found this at my dad's prison. I think it might help us to feed him. That's the spell to defeat Mr. Redface. Come on, quickly, go into the closet to find where your mom is being held. Can I get into mine yet? No. Alright. Oh, she's not working today, huh? Oh, hey kids. What are you guys doing? Quickly, throw the spell in here and take cover. Oh, I gotta take cover. I think. Did I take cover? Eh. Oh, there's Mr. Redface. through the door. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Maybe. Maybe. Huh? What? What do I do? E. I don't know. Let me out of here. Why is it still windy? I'm inside my house. Oh. 
What's happening to you? My master has been defeated. The magic he cast on me is also fading. Are you disappearing? Don't worry. This is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. Parents? Dad! Mom! Y'all are free now! Oh. You've been having an affair, haven't you? I told you I was busy with work. Liar! You've been- you've neglected this family for another man! Aren't you ashamed to lie to your son? And what about you? Do you think you're better than me? You're just at home leeching off me all year round. What kind of father are you? No matter what I do, it's my business. I still bring money home to support my child. And if you still think I'm a bad person, you're lowering yourself even below that. Oh. One more word. Fine. You and I will get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. If you're still here tomorrow, I'll take my son and leave. You stay right there. Alrighty. Well, I, these are great parents. I've got great parents. You probably shouldn't. You probably shouldn't drink that. It's not gonna help your mood. St I, uh, maybe. Okay, okay, that's enough. Slow down. Uh, Now I know who Mr. Redface is. I won't let this happen. Um... Oh. Wow. This is very dark. I, I definitely will put some trigger warnings on this one. No, no, no. This cannot be true. I'm very sorry, Ron. Your closet. I think you're able to open it now. It's, oh, it's me that's in there? This is me? Why do I know why don't I know anything about these? You've always known. Because I am the knowing part of you. You've tried to deny and reject these things and made up stories to make yourself feel better about your you and your dad. And me. I have to find a way to lead you back to the reality. I've tried many times, many ways, to help you accept this truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, guess what happens? Tick tock boom, your memory resets back to the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? Fourteen days. It can't have been that long. What really happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap motel room. Go home with me, Dad. Now I can see why he was creeped out. What about 
my mom. She still sees me, doesn't she? That's right, because she's only at home late at night. But if it's daytime... Son? Wow. Do you have any clues about your husband's hiding place? You just dropped something, ma'am. What is that? It's a business card for a motel, but I'm not sure it's mine. Oh, that's- wow. Th okay, this was really good. If this was really this person's first game, I'm impressed at what's coming because this was a great story. Like, it started off um, talking about, like, kind of what this kid was imagining um, in the afterworld killer father arrested and then the spell card became the motel card to defeat the red face guy which was his dad so that's that was really well done and i'm excited to play more of these games by this person so great job on this and uh surprisingly the game is free i do recommend donating and the artwork is phenomenal too i really like it a lot the other kids. This is so sad. Oh, I am not going to cry. It is just a game. Ugh. There was one game that had me crying a long time ago. It was called That Dragon Cancer. Horrible. I was crying. I mean, it was a good game, but it was so sad. I'm going to turn it off here because uh, the music's playing. Thank you for watching and please check this person out. 2002 I guess is what they go by.